When you're learning medicine, there are two dominant ideas that you have to internalize. The first is that clinical medicine is built on a foundation of basic medical sciences. If you're learning a basic fact in histology or physiology, you've got to say, where do I use this in patient care? The second and harder idea is that every patient encounter starts with a chief complaint. Why are you here? And from that, you form a differential diagnosis. What are the most likely causes that I have to sort between? A common mistake students make when they're doing a chief complaint in a differential is that when they have the chief complaint, they don't reason through the possibilities, but instead get a shotgun and show it a thousand possible answers, hoping that one of them miraculously will be correct and they will then be able to move on. When they read the question, they're hoping that the writer will give them a little buzzword, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. This is all you need. Well, they don't. Not only do they not do that, they consciously read their questions and purge anything out of it that you could possibly use that way. And that way they're measuring, can you think like a doctor?